Y'all, it's still snowing. It's still snowing. This is where the snow at right now. This is where the snow at right now. We getting ready to come up out of here. Mm-hmm. We getting ready to come up out of here. What's up, y'all? First of all, I meant to clean up. One of those people, y'all, where it's like, oh, sorry, my house is a mess. And this is what my house looked like. It's just because there's like little things on the floor. But anyways, what is up, y'all? Welcome back to my channel. It's your girl, Dee Dee, with Misfit to Fit. And as you can see, the snow has taken over Minnesota. Not yet. I don't know where we moving to, but we moving the fuck up out of here. I'm tired. Oh, I knew I should have changed into my contacts because this lighting, I really don't like having glasses anymore. So uh, today, I am going to share my hit workout with you guys. That'll be a part of the fitness challenge. We'll sprinkle a little core in there. Sorry, I just took my pre-workout and I'm a little jazzed right now. But come with me real quick. And then we will get into the workout, okay? Okay, before I was a little gloomy. But I have been using Bucked Up's pre-workout. Woke AF for the last four months. The last one I got, I got it in September. Um, I only take a pre-workout break when I can't afford it and she can afford it, so she got it. <laughs> so I got bucked up. Okay. I need to go change my contacts, change into my contacts, because I can't do this. But the main reason why I like uh, Bucked Up's pre workout is because of the focus that is in it. So, pre workout, when you're doing pre workout, um, aside from the caffeine that gives you that jolt of energy, um, it does have another component in it. Certain ones do, which is a focus component, which helps you to focus as you are doing the workout. So yes, your heart rate is up. Yes, you are pumping. But at the same time, it's like you're thinking more about what you're doing rather than just trying to pump out as much weight and reps as you can. Their um, beta aline. Um, so if you guys get that tingly feeling, that's that beta ally, yeah. Um, called alpha size, which is like a prime ingredient for the focus. Um, sharpens your mental focus, obviously. And then there's the strength component in there. It makes you feel like you can pump way more than you typically can. And I like that because I be psyching myself out sometimes when I see the weights. If you guys have seen some of my workout videos with my girl Hemery, she goes in, okay? She is one of those people where she'll do her workout and she'll like bang out maybe 10 or 20 extra pounds on top of that each rep. And I'm like, I strive to be like that, but I'm such a chicken. I don't like to, you know, make myself, take myself out of like my comfort weight level, which is like under the hundreds. And now I'm, you know, banging out 200s and 300s on leg presses and shit like that. So I'm like, okay. I like that and I want to be like that. So that is why I chose to go for a pre-workout that had higher stimulants in it. More focus, more strength, more pump for me because I feel like that helps me focus a little bit more. Now that the pre-workout is pumped in me, I am drinking my water. I'm going to change my glasses into my contacts and I'm going to start off the workout. So I'll meet y'all on the floor. As you are setting up for your workout, you want to make sure that you give yourself enough space. Um, so if you got to move some couches, move some tables around just to get your workout in, girl, go ahead and do it. Right before I start my workout, I like to do a warm up or a musical break, um, get myself hyped and ready for what I'm about to go through. For We're gonna start off with some dynamic stretches, um, opening up those hip flexors, stretching out those hamstrings, making sure your core stays engaged while you're doing that. And then we'll do a couple arm circles forward and back just to, again, warm up before we actually do the workout. 
this is important if you want to move effectively and be able to have your body go into full range of motion while you're still doing um, HIIT workouts. It's very important. Now if you look at the top left corner of your screen, there are modifications that I've included. This is if you are trying to complete the workout without stopping um, and just to keep yourself moving or if you aren't able to do a lot of jumping. your water. You need water. Alright, for core we have three exercises, two rounds, six to tw 12 to 20 each round. Let's go.
Yeah.